So catching up where I left off. Um, I've just upgraded that train. My fucking ass is numb now, sat on this. Uh, I've filled that train, click send. I'm now level 2, wonderful stuff. Uh, when you, you reach new levels you can unlock new stuff, which is obviously there, right in front of you, you can see. I've got one lucky book, which you do every level. One boost, I think that is, I'm not quite sure what that is. And one instant fuel, which you can click on a train, which is already running, and get it straight back to you. So, I'm going to click down there, the button. I'm going to have to move my ass, see, hang on, bloody hell. Um, the button says create train routes, there, so I'm going to click that. And I have, like, like I said, Facebook friends, I've only got two at the minute, because nobody actually knows it exists. Um, no Facebook requests needed for an engineer finder. Um, you can add that woman there for two lucky books, but I don't want to do that. So I'm going to add Sheridan, and what that basically does is brings up this, and you can send a lucky train request to the friend. Click send, and that will also give the other player 20 coins. It's not much really, but it's better than no. And I shall also invite my other one friend on there, Curran Veer, Sergeant X Coco from the League, if people are wondering who that is. Offered 20 coins. So that's that, and I'm going to click on this, because I've never actually clicked on this. We will locate new Lucky Train players for you and automatically add them to your route. No Facebook requests required. You can connect to 10 more engineers, so find an engineer. We've created a train route for you. Also, you are now in the queue for another route soon. You just got achievement for first cross country train route, yep. Yeah. So basically that's how to create routes. Uh, let me put it back to full screen. Uh, that's how to create routes and I've got three trains ready. I've got the Toff to whoever that bloke is. Shizedic. Um, the Toff to Sheridan which is obviously my cousin. And Toff to Caranvia. And I click to bring the next train in. Look some other rando. There's a Filipino. As you can see down the bottom there. I can add other stops to this, like I can add another stop just by pressing that and you know I can do that if I really want to find an engineer and they've extended that train route so it takes 8 hours and basically that's how you can do it, or you can add your friends um, that's how to create routes, I'm going to fill that train up, in fact I'm going to upgrade it as well here we are, look, Lucky Books. You can use Lucky Books to un upgrade the trains. But you want to keep hold of them for as long as you possibly can. Um, because it's going to be a long one, this one, I'm going to buy one of them. So it takes you from 8 hours to 3 hours 20 minutes. So I've successfully done that. And it's full, so I can send it. And that's going on its first run. So it'll be back in 3 hours 20 minutes. And you can see there, when you do a, an objective on your missions, it will come up with a big arrow pointing to it, and it'll say progress on the clipboard. So you click that, and you can see there, train car supervisor, 2 of 3. Uh, I need to create two local routes, but I've done the upgrade one train, and I've done the create one cross-country run. Um, as you can see the rewards as well there, there's uh, 3 instant fuel, 250 coin and a composite XL train. So I'll bring the next train in now, and it's a crappy little green one, so I shall definitely be upgrading that. Now, when you've added a friend, they need to accept it uh, to be part of the route, I cannot add another stop until um, it, well, this one's Karen Veer. Um, until Sergeant X accepts this part, of, uh, the, me as part of his route, then I can move on to the next person once he's accepted it. But until then, you can't do it. So let's upgrade this. Oh, 
Where's the compass? It's gone. Well, I could swear. Oh, I ain't got any money, that's why. Right. I've only got 133 coins. So I'll shove all these on the platform. And you, you've probably saw there, it popped up. Um, you can click on this, you know, when when passengers are ready to be sent to a train station. You click on it and sometimes um, it'll give you like a collection item which goes into your collections. So if I click on achievements there, you can see this is part of my collections. I've got one of these, whatever one of them is. Uh, part of the housewarming collection and you can trade them in for certain stuff so you get a full collection as in all four of them you can trade it in for 150 coins um, the civic collection you can get all of them it's 100 xp all of them it's one instant fuel one building boost and we click down there it, one business collection and it's a thousand coins um, also the achievements here you can see all the stuff that you've got, all the achievements, now they obviously give you XP as you're doing it. So I shall send that off and I've got one more to do. And I've got one last thing to touch on before um, I come off this game. So I've reached level 3 and I've got another lucky book, building boost, um, a thing in my bob. And now I can create one more new route. And I've unlocked the apartment building. Make this route longer by adding a friend as a new stop. I don't want to do that. Not yet, anyway. I shall do that by myself. Uh, depending on if anybody actually adds me from these um, videos that I'm doing. Now, you may see, like that there, it says click to upgrade in blue just underneath there. 10 of 10. Uh, once you've sent 10 passengers from a building like that, um, you, you, can, you can upgrade the building. So let's click on that now. I don't know if we've got enough money to do it. Yes, I do. Uh, level 2 building <coughs> excuse me, will give you a higher passenger. So instead of getting an economy passenger, which gives you 3 gold every time you're selling them, you get a standard passenger, which gives you 4 gold and two more XP. Uh, these take a little longer to produce, let's say, but they do give you more revenue. So I've upgraded that. And that's part of one of my tasks that I needed to do. And obviously the house gets bigger. Um, and you can do this with... Well, I, actually I'll, I'll say first before I go. Um, you'll see that the numbers change, none of 25 so once you've done 25 passengers from this one house you can upgrade it again uh, to the highest rated which gives you luxury passengers um, I can't put anybody else on the station at the minute, there is one train waiting this is the last train of today uh, and I'm going to add stops, I'm going to add him onto it and I'm going to add the Baron onto it as well, so I've got three stops there a far stop bonus which gives you more coin and more XP you'll you'll gradually get the hang of it as you're doing it the, this train has taken an unexpected detail we have updated your schedule with the correct information All right, fair enough right so that's lucky train um, it's not going to be everyone's cup of tea and you can feel free to agree with uh, disagree with me it is more fun um, with a lot of, with many people in your friends list that have also got this game and it's also more fun than I'm making it sound because my voice is actually quite dry at the minute I need some fucking beer, that's what I need, it's over there I can't reach it so I'm going now, that's my two reviews um, of today uh, tomorrow's review will be Cityville and Frontierville so I'll be looking forward to doing them for you